All right, here we are four months in the making and the van is so close to being ready for me to fully move in. But I still have a couple of things to work on before then and one of those things is actually really important. I need to figure out what filmmaking gear I'm gonna bring with me when I actually move into the van, like for real. Because regardless of how much I wanna bring all this stuff, I just know that it won't all fit. So for the very first time in my freelance career, I have to use less gear. But I really don't, I don't know what gear I should sell and which gear I should keep, you know? Because I still wanna do client videos. So I think we're gonna have to go on a road trip and do some client work to figure that out. <laughs> And by client work, I mean pick up one of my best friends and drive 3,000 miles across the country to shoot some music videos. So meet my friend Matt. He's a singer, songwriter that specializes in quoting old Vine jokes. Roadwork ahead. I sure hope it does. <laughs> I've made some music videos for him in the past, but on this trip, I really want to take these videos to the next level for him. All right. Ugh. Ugh. Here's the plan. Here's a list of all the gear that I brought to help film these three music videos and this YouTube video on this road trip. And I wanna see what I actually use. So as we go through shooting these videos, we'll get to check off each piece of gear so we can definitively see, definitively, so we can definitely see what is needed and what isn't needed. And to make things interesting, I brought the drone, which is weird for a minimalist setup, but I didn't bring the gimbal. So we'll see if I actually want that or not. Keep it interesting out here. So let's get to shooting. Oh, how about this view, by the way? This place is beautiful. Dude, honestly, this whole monitor setup, I'm like the monitor's annoying me. I thought it would make the handheld footage look better because it like adds, adds more weight to it. But I wish I would just have a gimbal for those like smooth, oh, those so shots. Like when Ryan needs the gimbal. Yeah, all right, cough, let's go. <laughs> oh shit, that was fast. I guess I should have brought the gimbal. We also weren't super excited about the cloudy day shots that we were getting, so when the sun finally came out, we picked back up and we got super stoked. So much so that I actually got ahead of myself and forgot my Promis filter. Come on, hurry up before the sun goes down. Coming, coming. What's up? I'm actually really liking doing this without the monitor. Okay, cool. It's such an easier setup, dude. The Same. monitor was distracting, actually. I feel like a monitor helps in like huge productions. Yeah. And you have to yeah. like sit way back. And it makes you look cooler for like like corporate clients and stuff. Yeah. That yeah. was so <laughs> sick, dude. Like honestly, <laughs> that was so cool. Look at this. Come here, look at this. Dude. This is literally next level. Dude. 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 Everything's on point. This looks so good. Everything's on point. All right, if we're keeping score for our first location here, so far I've used this the FX3, so the Sigma 24 to 70, my microphones, and the monitor. But I definitely do want to ditch the monitor. Now onto the next location, Mars. <laughs> Just kidding. All right, so before we head out to the Salt Flats to film the second music video of this trip, we just had an idea for the most epic shot I think that's gonna make, might be our favorite shot for the whole trip. Uh, so what we're thinking is a slow-mo shot in the Salt Flats at Utah, and um, just running, tearing different layers of clothing off, kind of symbolizing the uh, the free feeling. Just running, tearing clothes off. Slow mo. Not completely naked. <laughs> not well. For the clicks. Not completely. For naked. the clicks, dude. We don't need my ass. My ass is already on the internet somewhere. But if we're both gonna be sprinting through the salt flats, I think that definitely calls for a gimbal. And I don't. You know, I didn't bring a gimbal, so. All right, literally all they had was this Zion Weeble S. So let's give this, I'm, honestly, I don't even know if it'll work with the FX3 because the FX3 is so heavy and chunky. Drop the money and don't know if it's gonna work. No, yeah, I'm not entirely sure if it'll work. <laughs> and while we're figuring this out, Arr. Let me tell you about today's sponsor, Envato Elements. They call themselves the Unlimited Creative Subscription. It's honestly such a good deal for what you get. They have a bunch of stock videos, photos, sound effects, songs, graphics, and a bunch of other stuff. Actually, all the songs, sound effects, and graphics in this video are directly from Envato Elements. It's only 33 bucks a month if you pay for their monthly plan, and that gives you unlimited access to the entire Envato Elements library, as well as the licensing so you don't have to worry about the copyright stuff. Hey, dude, it totally works. Anyways, thank you Envato for sponsoring this video so we could go on this sick road trip. And if you're watching and you wanna use stuff from Envato Elements in your videos, go ahead and click that first link in the description. 
What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Ryan Michaels here. Uh, just wanted to say thank you so much for tuning in uh, to the last few videos. I know I've been kind of MIA lately. We're out on a major road trip, but uh, I have a new gimbal review coming your way soon. <laughs> that was good! <laughs> They make the coolest freaking music videos ever, dude. Let's do it. Let's, 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 let's let our balls sweat off. <laughs> Whoa, oh. Holy shit, dude. Oh my god, listen. You hear that wind? We turn on the lights. Holy shit. The whole van is shaking right now. I think we should probably leave. Yeah. Let's yeah. let's let's go before it's too late. Also, I have salt all over my body. <laughs> dude, we just got salt whipped by the wind. That really did though. Oh. Okay, talk <laughs> that's about got, that's got nothing to do with the wind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, 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 well, I hope we got all the shots we needed before we got salt blasted. While we were there, I finally used the drone and the new gimbal for that one shot that I think came out pretty sick. It was probably worth picking that up. So to come to kind of a conclusion here about my gear, now we know the official stripped down kit that I'm gonna bring with me when I move into the van is gonna be the FX3, the 24 to 70, which I'm both filming on right now, it's just beautiful. Uh, my microphones, the new gimbal, and I want to bring just one light even though I didn't use it on those uh, music videos that we just did, but I know that I'll definitely use it when I do some interviews with any corporate clients or anything down the road. Oh man, I could tell I'm back in Florida. It's so hot in here. And on that note, I'm gonna have to go sit down for a couple days and start editing these music videos. I think they already came out insane. They, they look really sick. I'm so happy about that stuff that we made. So if you want to hear about when those music videos get released, go ahead and subscribe to me here on YouTube and follow me on Instagram because I'll make a post on both of these platforms about when those videos are ready to go and you guys can watch them. All right, onward and upward for some more adventures soon. I'll see you guys in the next one. Well, first night's sleep. Check in the van. Got a couple hours of sleep. I don't think it was too bad. Matt, how, how'd you do on the floor down there? How'd it go? I, I closed my eyes a little bit. <laughs> Hammock didn't work out, huh? <laughs>